Hey, what's going on, everybody out there in YouTube world? It's, uh, it's a little late, but, um, I just want to tell you that I, I, mean, I apologize that you can't really see this, so let's just, uh, turn on this light here for a minute. All right. It's a little something. Earlier today, I did a review on the Timberwolf. I'll show you in a second under the light. Timberwolf, TW1041, okay? And um, it was a pretty, it was like a 18, 19 minute video. A little bit ago, I go, to, I go to post it and view it and you only see like the first three minutes. I was doing some chopping and a, a little piece of hose <laughs> must have hit the camera and that was it. So if you go play the video and I didn't preview it, all you're going to hear is me mumbling something and the locust totally, totally took over the show and uh, that was it. And then like nothing else, like it was like a blank screen. So we're going to do this on another day. I mean, overall, I got this from BUDK.com and I'm trying to keep it down because somebody's sleeping in the room behind me. Um, but uh, overall, it's like, you know, out of 10, seven, I'd say seven out of 10. It feels incredible in hand. It feels really good in hand. I love it, all right? But I think I was misled. It's full tang. It's from Pakistan. It's, I don't have a problem with that. It's like a quarter of an inch thick. Got the brass guard, but, oh, 3CR13 steel, which is, which is very cool. I'm going to get a closer look on it, but, um, I think I was misled. It was, it was like between 45 and $50, and it said in like the, the main description, you know, bone and wood handle, and then I receive it, and I'm like, this looks all wood to me, so I go back. It still says bone and wood handle, but now in the description it says wooden handle, so I don't know. Do any of you own this guy out there? All right? Anyone? This thing went through my big old half-gallon turkey hill like nothing. I love that feeling when it could just bust through a big old bottle like that. The water goes everywhere. It's a chopper. It's not really like a cutter, you know, a shaver. It's... It, it seems to lack that, but um, uh, it was like that when I do that water bottle thing, you don't know is it going to go through or not. It's it's like going up the log flume, you know. Remember the ride the log flume, and you just you go down the thing, and you just really want to get wet, and you know, that's what it feels like. Am I going to get soaked? Is the water going to go everywhere, or is it going to be a dud? Well, this was a success, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I so apologize you can't see it. Worst video ever, but um, anyway, <laughs> I had a phone call earlier, and it's a, it's an anniversary of sorts, and it's important to me because I haven't played in bands or sang or anything in like ten years, and my daughter got me to go to Nashville. So she takes me to this bar, and there's this band playing, and we asked if I could sing a tune. So they all said they know the song, but they never played it live, you know? So the tune is, uh, I think it went over really well. So check it out. These guys are brilliant. I mean, they knew the tune, but never played it. So no rehearsal, no nothing. We, I just went up, we did it. I would give them a couple cues here and there. I needed background vocals, and I gave him like the eye, and then he started. So, so just check it out. I'm gonna leave you the link. It was like the first video I ever posted. So it's an anniversary of sorts. And ever since that night, I've been back there like two, three times now. Uh, this time I take a guitar player with me, and we just, you know, we do a little bar hopping, and we just ask the band, you know, can I sing? And hey, if you tip them right, they'll let you sing all night. So. You know, it was a lot of fun. So check out that link if you want to hear, you know, Cowboy Seabop do Elvis. So anyway, check out this knife. I'm going to get you a, a, a better close-up on it. All right.
the Timberwolf TW1041. It's got, it's a blue and sapphire handle. Again, I ask you, does anybody own it? Do you see any bone in there? Anywhere? <laughs> I know I need glasses, but I sure it does look uh, wooden to me. Brass guard, 3CR13 blade. I used it for like, you know, as I said, like 20 minutes, just beating the crap out of it. And the blade still looks awesome. Okay? Uh, roughly 45 to 50 bucks. One more time, Timberwolf, TW1041. I apologize with all my heart that you can't see that video. So, you know, it is what it is. Uh, at least I'm doing something, right? But, um, and the sheath is high quality leather. And you can smell it from here. Take a whiff. Pretty cool, huh? So anyway, thank you for watching everybody. And, uh, as always, be careful out there, everybody. Take care.